What a story this is. A convicted murderer escaped from an Arkansas prison. Police say that Timothy Buffington walked away from a work assignment, managed to break into a house on prison's grounds, and stole a shotgun. How did this happen? He briefly took a hostage before he escaped. Buffington was sent to prison after gunning down his ex-wife. Chief Correspondent Jonathan Hunt is live with more on this. So, Jonathan, how, I mean, how does this happen? He walked away? Yeah. It seems pretty extraordinary, and it seems that that is exactly what happened. 47-year-old Timothy Buffington literally just walked off the grounds of the Randall L. Williams Correctional Facility in Pine Bluff, Arkansas. That's just south of Little Rock. He was on this work detail, apparently busted into a house on the prison grounds, took that shotgun, and then took a hostage for a short time. Once she got away, she called 911. Listen here. Mandy. But we need we need some assistance as soon as possible because he is armed and he will shoot. Okay, you're stuck. He has ammo and he has a shotgun. I'm okay. not sure what else he's gotten a hold of. Now, Buffington has now been on the run, Martha, for some four days. No sign of him uh, since that woman hostage was taken by him. Uh, obviously, given that he has a shotgun and ammo, he is considered armed and dangerous, Martha. It's a really scary story. Yeah. Well, what is his history, Jonathan? Well, he back in July of 1998, he murdered his ex-wife, shot her in the head, the back of the head, as she she sat in a pickup truck with her then boyfriend. He was sentenced to 20 years. Officials say he's had a clean disciplinary record since then. No history of escape attempts until now. Description He's five foot six inches, 182 pounds, apparently has scars on his upper left arm and his right wrist. By the way, Martha, he also told that hostage that he took for a short time that he just wanted to go somewhere. And think. Mm. Martha?